all know what time it is. I'm so incredibly excited. We're just getting straight into it. Whoa, whoa, this is so cool. And so different than the other ones. Whoa, hi. Like I said at the start, this needs no introduction, guys. This is Portal Revolution. This mod has been literally everywhere. Like, I swear to God, I went on TTube one day and suddenly it was just boom, everybody playing Portal Revolution, everyone talking about it. I've been behind. It came out, I think, back in January. It's been on the top of my list to play, and I'm so excited to finally be playing it. I have no clue what to expect from this. I don't know what this mod is about. I know nothing about it. We're going in, like, 100% blind. I'm so excited. All right, new game. The Human Resource. There's so many chapters. All right. Please remain calm. This ex interactive experience is currently blah, 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 blah. I am remaining calm. Actually, I'm not really remaining calm. I'm so excited. I'm remaining ecstatic. Human resource. Whoa. Hi. Oh, we're just right to control here. Oh, we're moving. We're moving along. We have a hole in our ceiling. We have a microwave! And a mini fridge, but a microwave! Oh. So I'm assuming we're in some kind of ruins because we have a whole hole in our ceiling. So something's happened to the facility. Oh? We're being taken out of our, out of our little schnoozy schnooze, our little nap. Where are we going? Into the wall, question mark? Down? Morning test subject. You have been in suspension for 72 days. 72? Psh, that's nothing. The Aided Enrichment Center congratulates you on your 36 year sleep anniversary. Oh, we've been You have been sleeping. selected as a potential candidate for our Human Emergency Response Team. Please <gasps> review the agreement provided on the nearby monitor. Oh, hold up. First, before I do that, I want to look around and explore things. You sound so happy. Telephone. 9.32. Bright and early in the morning. Oh, hello! Whoa! Fit check! Into the human emergency hold up, hold up. Fit check, fit check. You will now oh. participate oh. in an advanced difficulty testing Hi. track where your problem-solving oh, okay. skills, hold athleticism, up. in response to increasingly hazardous conditions will be evaluated. Right, got it. That's a lot the there. to accept the terms. I can't even read anyways. Boink! Thank you for volunteering. <laughs> of course! The door will open in three, two, one. Ooh, what a, what a, what a cool countdown. Oh, hello. Maybe things aren't in ruins. Well, actually, he said emergency response team. I don't even know when this game is set, guys. I'm trying to, like, piece things together already. Right into testing we go. Whee! And up the elevator. Wahoo! What emergency are we responding to? I could be a firefighter. I could do that. I couldn't be a doctor, though. Not on, -uh, no way. But, like, if there's a fire, I'm on it, coach. Put me in. Well, that's glass. Oh, guys, I don't- I don't know if I could do this test chamber. Um, guys, I don't- I don't- I don't think I could do it. Will this hurt me? No, it won't. Oh, crunchy. ASMR? This one might be a little too tough. I don't know. I'm just kidding, I can do it, guys. Easy peasy. We went from solving such difficult tasks in Portal Stories Mel. I can walk through a door. I... Please remain calm, please remain calm. Well, when you put it that way across so many subjects streams. subjects may experience symptoms of mental defects after long-term chemically induced hibernation. Not me. You will now participate in a brain damage evaluation survey to determine just how damaged your brain is. Oh, exciting! If you believe your brain is sufficiently operational, press the button in front of you and continue the test. Well, the more I think about it, the more the more I wonder, is is my brain really sufficient? Is it gonna have any more dialogue options? I wanna know. Mr. Robot Voice Man, um, I actually think you might need another candidate. Uh, can you like just open the door and I'll 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 go back to sleep? Yeah, I could use like another hour of sleep. And then I'll be good to go. Yeah? No? 
Okay, fine. We'll get my beauty sleep. Very good. Please walk through okay. the portal and continue testing. Your self-reported status is more what? than sufficient for testing. Wahoo! All right. Boink! Got you, Mr. Cube. Hello, hole in the wall. Lovely. Shpadoink. Through here we go. And I guess just straight through here. There's so many holes everywhere. Something did happen. Something's happened to the facility. That's what we've got going on. <gasps> Are you gonna land on the button? Ooh, stairs. We have another thing over here. Ah, interesting. And I'm willing to bet that we get... I wonder what that button does over there. <gasps> oh, does it? It probably spawns another cube. Ready for this, guys? We put that down there. We go through here. That's also such a cool wall. Look at that. Whoa! When we press this, then it'll, it'll give us a new cube. And then we'll get the stairs. Guys, kind of crushing it. Kind of crushing it. What can I say? I'm kind of a puzzle genius. Don't quote me on that, like, three chapters later when I'm struggling through these chambers, though. Please be advised that noticeable damage to eyesight is not part of any test protocols, but it's an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material oh, Emancipation Grill, which in semi-rare cases may emancipate some of the light-sensing rods and cones inside your head. That's okay. I didn't need them anyways. Eyeball schmeyeballs, you know? Like, they don't really matter that much. Hi. That nearly just shot me right in the face. Oh, okay, I see. We're gonna want to get that, aren't we? Okay, cute. <gasps> portal gun! Yes! I am now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal Wahoo! device. Oh, but we only have one of them right now. As a candidate now. for the okay. human emergency response team, you are expected to adapt to all dangerous situations, and as such, will not be informed about the device's safety hazards. It's okay. Sometimes it's better to not ask questions and just to not know. Ah, so we only have the blue portal right now. So we're gonna have to get the orange one. Just like in the second game, was it? Yeah, I think it was the second one. Where we had to go and get the orange one as well. Okay, Mr. Robot Voice Man, tell me, what, what do we got going on? What's happening? What's good? Your performance in the next test chamber will be time to measure puzzle solving and execution speed during oh, extreme not wind and weather conditions. Oh. In the rare case that wind and weather conditions appear to be ordinary, Please stay idle in the entrance foyer until the desired conditions are met. At first I thought that said, please stay idle in the entrance forever. And I was like, forever? Um, I'm not seeing a whole lot of wind, but you know, it's a, it's a, that's fine. I don't, we don't need wind anyways. You know, less for me to worry about. Got a platform up here, question mark? What does this give us? We got this over here. You open that, but how do we get you through the grill? Huh. Interesting. How do we get you through the grill? Because you're gonna... Ah, that one stays... Okay, wait, never mind. I got it, guys. Hold up, hold up. I've got it. I forgot that the, um... The orange portal just stays up there. Ready for this? Boom, 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 boom. Aha! Shpidoink! On it, man. Oh, hello. Um. I keep on trying to right click, and I'm like, no, I can't right click. I can't go back. Uh. Then where am I supposed to? Ah! <laughs> it just right on the platform. It wasn't supposed to be that complicated. I see. Okay, this does that. Lovely. We got some lovely, lovely stairs here. And we've got a cube over here. Boink! Okay, so we have orange over that away. We need to get you up there somehow, which means that we're gonna have to get you over here. 
and then we can put you down there, and then we can shoot you up there, and then we can go right on through here. Boop. Long. There we go. And stop. Congratulations, test subject number one. You have set the world record for this exercise. World and now record. officially hold first and last place on the leaderboard. Oh my god. Do I get a trophy for that? Anything? You know, I'll take a congratulations. What can I say, guys? I'm just, you know, I'm the best test subject. I'm just... I'm just that good. What can I say? What can I say? Okay, what do we have here? Uh, shouldn't you know? Aren't you Mr. Robot Voice Man who's like omnipotent? <laughs> the next test may contain concentrated amounts of electromagnetic radiation that may be harmful to Yay! the readiness of some humans. The some Enrichment humans Center not recommends me. to solve this test with closed eyes, as health insurance will not be provided for this specific exercise. That's okay. In I don't, I don't need health insurance anyways. rods and cones of your eyes have previously been emancipated by an emancipation grill, feel free to ignore the prior oh. warning. Got it. Got it. That makes sense. So what do you do? You... I actually don't know what you do over there. Do you matter? Do we need you? Oh, we do kind of, we, we need something over here. Okay, wait, what did you do? Oh, so that turns that into, got it. Right, that makes sense. So what if we have a way in and out here? We turn you over here? That also opens that over. Oh, can we just hop over the laser? I was, I was so confused. I forgot that the, oh my God, two brain cells rattling around up in here. I, I forgot that I had the portal there and I was like, wait, how did that open? It's because the portal's there and the laser's going through over there now. And then we'll just, you know, hop around the laser, you know. And we'll escape through. Did it with eyes open. Still got two eyeballs in my head. They're still functioning. Like, what can I say? Just simply you have completed build it the test. If you have not done so already, you are permitted to open your eyes. Already on it, man. Already on it. I'm just built different. What's up next? Oh, moving on to the next thing. Okay. I'm just flying through these. I'm a portal whiz, man. Before starting with the next test chamber, we would like to remind you that, so far, no experiment has yet unproven whether or not weighted storage cubes are not incapable of not feeling pain when being emancipated. That's a great way to start this off. I'll be sure to bear that in mind. Hello, cube! I hope that cubes don't scream in this game. That would make me really sad. Okay, you're crushing it. You're amazing. You're so good. If I accidentally murder you, that's my bad. <laughs> That'd be really unfortunate, I know. Um, okay, so we gotta get back up there. Over there, through here. And then we have the exit over on that side. Ah, okay, so I see what, what our little conundrum is. Oh, and this is why you were telling me about the cube. Hey, listen, I apologized already. I said I'm sorry. I'm sorry again. Um, have a good time up in cube heaven or wherever cubes go. Okay, good, it didn't scream. That would be brutal if it did. Okay, so that's open over there, over there, and through here. I love the start of this game when puzzles start off, you know, somewhat basic and you fly through them and you feel really smart. It's making me feel great, guys. I love this ego boost. It's fantastic, especially because like two chapters from now, my ego's gonna be totally in the floor when I'm struggling to do like all of these puzzles. All right, let's keep them coming. Let's keep the puzzles going. Hello. Oh, whoa, wait. I've never noticed how like all rainbow it is. That's so cool. 
so we have a laser over there. I always forget I can't use the orange portal yet. She's not working. Oh, okay, let's just, you know, do yield, yield swap around. Yield switcheroo. Shpadoink. All right, and then just through there. Boink. Ooh, get a crossover little bridge here. Number six, conservation of momentum. <gasps> do we get to fling ourselves through the air? That's always so much fun. Oh, we do. Oh. Well done, candidate. You have successfully solved five test chambers. To ensure a high quality of human resources, the following test chambers may include elements of danger. Yes, Extra I can tell. Is advised. Good luck. Got it. Luckily for me, danger is my middle name. Live, laugh, danger. Okay, so we're gonna need to somehow get back over there. Ah, no, I'm being so silly. We don't even need to go back over there. We've already done the hard part. The cube just needs to do the hard stuff now. Ready, gonna catch it? Oh, man, so good at this. Danger's my middle name. Caution is it? So I just run straight into danger. On the Center, I wish to apologize about the quick, 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 quick. state of our testing facility. Quick, 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 Due to quick, quick, quick. technical difficulties, we are unable to provide an experience of suitable quality at this time. Oh no! It's okay, don't worry. I get it, it happens. Your facility, you know, falls apart every now and then. You know, happens to the best of us. Okay, so we have a cube over here. We have a cube over here. Interesting. What does this do? Ah, you get rid of that there. Okay. So we need a laser, I'm assuming, there. And we need to get our cube up here. Curious. Oh, you spawned the portal there. What? Huh. Oh, and you start the laser. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. And oh, there's a button over here. Okay. Can I, like, run fast? Oh. See, that's a little unfortunate. Um, <laughs> and this isn't gonna be able to fly over, is it? No. Sorry, cube. Oh, jeez. Okay. I wasn't expecting to get locked in there. Um. Okay. I wonder. Can we? You take. You take a little bit of time, don't you? You do. Huh. So remember what I was saying about being a portal whiz? Um, I might have actually lied a little bit. Yeah. This suddenly got tricky. Oh, what if we... I remember doing something like this in... Um, oh my god, why can't I remember its name right now? I remember doing something like this in... What was it? Um... Ah, uh, Portal Reloaded! There's just so many mods. I remember doing something like this in Portal Reloaded where you had the two bouncing back and forth. So we wait for that one to go through. We go here, we step on you, you fly over. There we go! Got it, okay, fantastic. Now we can put you there. We can have, what do you do? You do the laser, right? Now we can just press this button, right? No, we can't. It's a little more tricky than that. Actually, no, it isn't. Hold up, I totally just lied. We can literally just do the same thing again on this side. We have it go up and down and up and down. What can I say, guys? I love lying. There we go, over here. Boink, got it. All right, then we'll plant you over here for that. Um. Oh, how do we get... Let me, let 
let me think about how we're gonna get the other cube over here, though. Can I, like, stand on this and throw it through? What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> You're so close! Wait, but now if I get off of this, it's gonna be emancipated, isn't it? No, okay, it was close enough, we're good. Okay, yeah, minor dilemma. Oh, wait, no, guys, hold up. Ignore everything that I literally just said. We literally just used that. We put you over here. You go there. I got it, I got it. Put two and two together. <laughs> and then you just go through. Got it, guys clicked into place eventually. Now we can go through. Which way am I going? There's there's so many ways to go. Hello. Ah, we can spy on ourselves. Hold up, now I want to go through all these secret entrances and see where they all lead. Secret, secret, secrets. Hello. Curious. Something tells me we're gonna be going back here in the next test chamber. That we're gonna need to use, use all these doors for something. Interesting. They're all empty. Which means that there's no people in this facility. Which means that something happened to them. What exactly? I don't know. He's not together still. I'm starting to suspect that Mr. Robot Voiceman isn't actually Robot Voiceman, but that Mr. Robot Voiceman is actually a Mr. Robot Core? Perchance? As a, a core who wants to events, get out, possibly? could be misconfigured and launch objects into arbitrary directions. Be careful. That's okay. That's all good. <gasps> aerial faith plates! I love aerial faith plates. Whee! Oh, whoa! That was well, not the way I was expecting to go. Wrong. Give me a second. Wait. There. Try that. Does this go the right way? Oh, yay! <laughs> I thought it was gonna be able to break that again. Is this one calibrated right? Whoa! So that's why there are holes in the ceiling. Wait, wait, I, I want to go through the ceiling again. That was so cool. Hold up. Wait, that was so cool. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa. That's so cool. Okay, Um. What, what do we got going on? We have a thing over there. Let's drop you down there. Get the cube. Oh, or don't get the cube. Hold up. One second. Ah, okay. Hold up. I see what's happening. We're gonna have to catch it, aren't we? Got it, got it, got it. Is it busy? Okay, ready? Shpadoink. That goes through there. You're gonna drop. Catch you. Got it. <laughs> and now you go here, I assume? I don't know what that does for us. That gives us this. Interesting, okay. But how do we go through that? Got a little platform over there. Got this up here. We have a button there. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Okay, I've got it. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it that over there and then we'll fly across on it. What do we have here? What are you? Hello? Something with lasers possibly? I don't know what that thing is. Oh, it's a ball. Oh, what? Hello, I didn't know that we had those. I've only ever seen cubes, this is new. Okay, we'll wait for you to go through. Go down. We'll go through here. Got it. Oh no! We almost had it. Hold up. Just keep going up and down. Keep going up and down. Just you wait. I'll have you in like two seconds. Okay. Almost. 
Now we go. Got it. Okay. I'm scared to like set this down. I don't want to, you know, have it roll away from me. Okay. So you go there. Now, if we do, we have to uh, we have to fly through. Yeah, yeah. Okay, hold up. Go back, and then we're gonna go over here. And then we'll go through. We'll land here. We'll go up. Um. Oh, can I drop this? I don't want to drop it, guys. Oh no! I didn't think this one through. Okay, will you fall with me? No! Okay. This is, oh, no, okay. So we've gotta have you go through this alone, I think. Oh my god, okay. Or do we? No, I feel like we can do this. It was still going up. I feel like it'll make it. Wait, <laughs> that wasn't right. <laughs> I forgot I couldn't just jump straight into that. Okay, we want you... Oh, wait, hold up. I don't even have to go back down there. One second. I'm being so silly. I could literally just do this. There we go. Wait. Ah, oh, got it. I don't know why I went all the way back down there. That's new. Well That's so cool. From now on, all aerial fate plates should be configured correctly. I promise. Hopefully. I love the aerial, aerial fate plates. They're one of my favorite things. I love flying around. It's so much fun. Yeah, no, I'm pretty convinced that this robot voice is not like a GLaDOS robot well done, voice or something, you, you know what I mean? Final test chamber. This You're not an official person. Completing the testing track will grant you membership into the Aperture Science Human Emergency Response Team. Yay! That's so exciting! I'll officially be like a firefighter or whatever it is that you're expecting me to do. I don't know what it is. Okay, so we have a thing over there. What does that get us? Oh, we have a cube here. Hello, cube. Boink! Shpadoink. Kerplink. Over there. Ooh, an elevator. I see. Interesting. What did that do? Ah, okay. Okay. Right. So how are we going to get ourselves onto that elevator? because we need enough time to be able to get down there, and that goes up real fast. Let's think about this one. What if... Okay, we have that behind us. Can we do this? Wait, hold up. How far How far out will you go? Oh, I know what we can do. We take this, because there's the portal behind us there. We take this, you go through there, and then we can also control when the portal goes as well. So that way we can just take the portal there, go over here, get on top of this, portal there, and up we go. Now we've got a cube over here. Lovely. Um, which I'm assuming... Do we literally just need to put the cube down over there? Yeah, okay, cute, love that. Boink! For boink. Um, a little problem. We're probably gonna get lasered here, but that's okay. We have a cube to protect us. Okay, so you go there. Now. Now we can go back up there. Right, we go back up there because I remember that there are spots to put portals down up there. I'm doing, like, mental gymnastics left and right to figure this out, guys. That up there. We've got you here. Okay. So, what do we need you to do? We need... We need that cube. We need that cube to get... Up here. We need that cube to get over here, more importantly. Hold up. Um, oh, but how do we get that cube to get up here without, like, messing this all up? Huh. Oh, wait, duh, hold up. We just spawn a new one. Yeah, <laughs> easy. We spawn a new one because now we have a way up there. 
We can just go around through here. There we go. Straight on through. And we're all set, right? That's everything. Yeah! Got it, guys. Got it. Things are starting to click into place up here. Okay. As a reminder, your Aperture Science provided health insurance does not cover injury Let me or in. fatality from immolation from the Aperture Science. I didn't even know I had health insurance bridge. here. Rest assured that unlike your fragile human tissue, all Aperture Science equipment has been built to withstand temperatures of up to 4,000 degrees Kelvin. Yay! Okay, what's on this side? Cube. Cube. You know, all that matters at the end of the day is that my Aperture Science equipment is, um, you know, still intact. Doesn't matter if I'm intact, but as long as the Aper Aperture Science equipment is intact, we're all good. Aerial Faith Plate over here. Okay, interesting. Curious. We got a light bridge over here, too. Oh, hi, light bridge. Ah, that'll get us over there. But we have actually no problem here. So that gets us over onto this side. Then we have a laser over there, which I don't really know what that's doing for us. I'll be so for real. Um, interesting. Let's get the... Oh, I see. I see where the problem exists. I see where the problem is. The problem's here because we have a cube and the cube is keeping this open side where we can pass through. Sick, okay. What does blocking that over there do for us? Hold up, Boink. I'm wondering if blocking that does anything. Like, does it stop? It does stop that, okay. Interesting. Interesting. God, this would be so easy if we just had the orange portal. The fact that it's locked in place keeps on throwing me off. <laughs> okay, so you do that. So we're gonna, I'm assuming we're just gonna be slowly but surely like sliding you out of there. That's what I think we, is what we have going on. So we have this blocked over here. Um, you can go like there, and then we're gonna have to block you over there. So that we can pass through here. But we still run into the problem of how do we get you across? Actually, is it that much of a problem? Do we even, hold up, do we even need this? Wait. No, we do, hold up. Because we need to get up there first. So that way we can get back and forth here and get a cube. The mental gymnastics are going crazy right now. Stop watching me! Don't watch me! You're stressing me out! Can I not destroy you? Oh, no, I can't. Okay. I see. Now we just need to get you over into this side here. Right. Right. Okay. Interesting. Oh, we get over here. That's what I was gonna do. We get over here, we go over here, we get on the aerial faith plate. I got it. It clicked into place. We get onto you, boing! Over here, through here, new cube, grab you, go here. Uh, we actually don't need you blocking that. Ready, slam dunk, shwonk. Now we just have the question of how to get across, which can't be too tough, right? Or it can be a little tough. Um, might, might be a little tough. Actually, hold up, hold up.
Well, we have the cube over there. That's that's the important thing. Right. Okay, I see the problem. Oh, you know what I should have done? Hold up. I think I messed up. I should have kept the cube blocking the laser. That's what I should have done. Oh, okay. Instead of going and putting it down right away, what we're gonna do instead is set up this light bridge so that way we can cross over onto the other side. And now we just go around. And now we can grab you, cause we'll be all set. Got it. Okay, I had all the steps, just not in the right order. I had to reverse engineer it a little bit. But we got there eventually. Okay, got through that one. <laughs> all right, what do we got going on here? Whoa! Hello? Congratulations! You did it! <gasps> what? Sorry for the surprise. Current testing protocol demands I dispose of oh, all hi, subjects. Whoa. So I had to intervene before you were, uh... Baked. Oh, I'll be honest cute. with you now. There is no after science human emergency response team. I made what? it up. Sorry for lying to you. Wait, so you mean Before I'm not going to be a firefighter? Before I can explain why I brought you here, we need to get you registered as an aperture employee. We don't want security systems to hunt you down after all. The guardian and intrusion system doesn't like it when test subjects escape the chambers. There's a security No, I learned that in the last game that Follow I played. Me. Wait, I want to look around. Um... I guess there's not a whole lot to look around at over here. One second. What am I what am I looking at? Button. No, okay, never mind. I'll just follow you. Can I go in here? No. Okay. Where are we going? This button? This button. Okay. Dark in here, isn't it? The check maybe you can get through this station. Oh sorry, I totally order. just <laughs> cut you off. Might be. No signal. Okay, cute. Got it. Through here and then boink boink. Where are we going? Oh, through here. Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off before. That was my bad. I got too excited. Hmm. The controls are manual, so I can't help you. Got a clue? Hmm. Oh, you are just right above me. Look at looking at me with those yellow, yellow eyes. Okay, so Hi. You have to stand <laughs> in the scanner to get registered. Hmm. Any plan how? I I don't know, man. I, this this is a real toughie. <laughs> Will he get annoyed if he eventually? Maybe that no. portal can help again. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> just kidding. I know what to do. I was just waiting to hear if he had anything to say. Oh wait, actually, just kidding. I totally lied. I thought that that was gonna spawn another portal. Um. Oh, okay. I see. Where are we? Oh, we stand over here. Are you <gasps> absolutely sure that door? Okay, right there listen doesn't open it doesn't okay now we i know. already tried it. it was worth a shot it was um listen i know what i'm doing i swear i figured it out eventually there we go scan me oh good yay idea. i think that did the trick good i know now register <laughs> you as our new janitor Welcome oh, so you'll manager. register me as a janitor, me but not Sterling. as a firefighter? I'm the facilities manager and your new supervisor. <gasps> Wahoo! Great to meet you, boss. You don't have hands. Um, m maybe a friendly nod of the head, Okay, then. we have no time to lose. Right this way. Up? Oh, through. Okay. Oh, wait. You, uh, can't go that way. No, I can't. Find way around. I have legs, unfortunately. I'm assuming I just go through here. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not on management rails. Um, I have legs. Ah, just through here. Wahoo! Well done. Not everyone gets this position, you know. You should be proud. Uh, if only I was a Cleaning firefighter. But humans that it's okay. don't exist anymore. Hmm. Yeah, not exactly the best position. Doesn't seem like I'm gonna be doing a whole lot, but that's okay. Easy job, easy money, you know? All right then, up we go. Yep, I'll see you up there in a second.
Intrudador! So what do we got going on here, Sterling? What's the sitch? What's happening? What's going on? I guess we won't know quite yet because that was the end of the chapter. The default route, I think is what it said. I'm invested, guys. I'm already invested. We're in the first chapter. We just met our first new friend, Sterling, a new core who hopefully won't turn out to be evil or anything. Hopefully he'll be, he'll be a nice guy. He seems like a nice guy. Um, I mean, we also got a job. Like, things are on the up and up for us, you know? But... That's all I have in store for today. I'm so excited to explore more of this. I believe that there's around six chapters, I think, total. So we've still got a whole lot to explore through. We've barely even skimmed the surface of this game. I hope you all have a lovely rest of your days, though. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you all for the rest of the series. Yes!